your gun, ready for action. You may ask for what action. At whom is the male pointing his gun? At you, and at you. Hey, you out there. Oh, well, where was I? Ah, oh, back to the gun. Girls, man has capitalized on his penis through centuries. He has used that to gain supremacy over women. He has fired so many with that, it might as well have been a machine gun. And yet, he has not succeeded in destroying us. You may ask why. I'll tell you why. Because we are the stronger of the two. We are superior to the man. We must stand up to him the same way he stands up to us. We must destroy his gun. He has shoved that into us, pumped that into us, and drilled that into us. It's no wonder we're coming up to here. The male organ is great in combat, but how is it outside of a battlefield? It is pumped. Is it sexually gratifying to women? No, it is not. What good is it then? Does it ever come in handy? Indeed it does. It comes into your hand and into mine. And personally, I find it disgusting. The Men's Liberation Committee has passed judgment on it, calling it a good for nothing. It has declared a full-scale war against the male. It has ordered his ammunition bags emptied and his gun destroyed. He is up to his neck in trouble, and now he's going to lose his head. There you are. Come on in. Get around this way. He'll probably walk through the door with his pants down and starts to shoot. What do you want with him anyway? He's a man. He's a man, pussy. He's a half a man. What is a half a man? Now I'm your mission guy. What about his gun? He has a gun, doesn't he? Even if he has, uh, he's so stupid. Uh, he doesn't know what it is. Uh, I mean, he is so stupid that even if someone put it in his hand, uh, he wouldn't know what to do with it. No one could be that dumb. He is. I tell just by looking at him. Let's put him to a test. Tell him to take it off. Yeah, take it off. Off. Take it off, dummy. Down. <laughs> 